Alright people, welcome back. More League. So, the regular season is over people. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up week 7 and uh, go into a little bit of detail about what's up with the playoffs. Because yes people, it's the playoffs. So we're just wrapping this up. We should have about, I would say, about 3 more weeks of League and then that's it. That's it for the end of Season 1. So let's just go ahead and hop into it. Let's just go ahead and go over what happened in week 7. So, this week... Pretty much nothing important really happened. I mean, there is no last second, oh, kick someone out of the playoffs, someone gets new, you know. There's pretty much, at this point, the spots were set, but for your entertainment's sake, we're just like, you know, let's go ahead and wrap this up. Everybody duel everybody. So, in match one, we had the Yuma Utopians using their Tier 3 Light Swarms versus the Yuya Pendulum Dragons using their Evil Swarms. Which, of course, you would think, you know, maybe the Evil Swarms would be able to go ahead and, you know, lock down JD or lock down Michael slash lock down BLS. But, no. The Light Swarms ended up winning it and earning themselves one point. In match two, we had the Yusei Star Dragons using Heraldics versus the Jack Red Archings using Fire Fist. So, Tier 3 versus Tier 2. And this was a divisional match, but... Uh, the Jack Red Archings ended up taking it, earning them one point, but still wasn't enough to get the bye week. So, just a duel for entertainment's sake. In match three, we had the Yugi Dark Magicians using what could be called Mermel Lanteans versus the Kabu White Dragons using Infernoids, and uh, that Mermel Lantean deck was not that good, and Infernoid ended up taking that, earning them two points. And in match four, we had uh, Slate not be able to make it to his duel so for just dueling sake i went ahead and used uh the zane cyber dragons black wings versus uh the kite galaxy photons tier one clown blades and i ended up beating lunar's ass but it didn't matter because how the league goes that since slate did not show up lunar got a point despite me winning so uh yeah that's how week four went so just to round it out and state what the scores are when the end of week 7, at this point, scores don't really matter anymore. It is pretty much elimination at this point for the playoffs. And the YCS division, end of week 7. And first, we have the Kabuya Dragons with 7 points. And second, we have the Kite Galaxy Photons with 5 points, which actually ended up passing up the Yuya Pendulum Dragons, who now have 4 points. And in last, the Yuma Utopians with 3 points. So, of course, how it goes, bottom team gets uh, knocked out, top team gets the bye week, so sorry you Utopians, you're out. So for the first week of the playoffs, we are going to see the Kite Galaxy Photons versus the Yuya Pendulum Dragons, and then the winner of that, those two will of course duel the bye week, the Kaiba White Dragons for the top of the division, for the division champion. And in the regional division, we have, in first, the Yusei Star Dragons with 8 points, in second, the Jack Red Archings with 6 points, in third, the Zane Cyber Dragons with 3 points, and in last, the Yugi Dark Magicians with no points. So, as stated before, the bottom team gets dropped, top team gets the bye week, so this week we'll be seeing the Jack Red Archings versus the Zane Cyber Dragons in the playoffs. Alright people, so you're probably wondering how the playoffs are going to work. So, pretty much how the playoffs are going to work is a little bit different than the regular season. Uh, just to make sure that all the teams are on their toes and know how to use all three decks. Instead of it just being, you know, one match, it's actually best of three matches, people. Yes. So we're going to have up to three different duels where they will have to choose, not in order, but their choice of which of the three decks they want to choose. It's just they cannot use that deck for the next one to two duels. So, in the YCS division, of course, we are going to have the Yu Pendulum Dragons versus the Kite Galaxy Photon, and the winner will be moving on to face the Kaiba White Dragons for the division champion. And in the regional division, we have the Zane Cyber Dragons versus the Jack Red Archfiends, and the winner will be facing the Yusei Star Dragons for the division champion, the regional division champion, uh, next weekend. And then, after that, we're literally going to wrap it up. <laughs> where we will be having the regional division champion versus the YCS division champion for the season one Yu-Gi-Oh! tier draft league champion. So anyway, I hope that you guys are looking forward to the playoffs. We've got plenty of videos for you guys to enjoy. So thank you guys for continuing to watch the league. Thank you guys for all the support. It's almost done. Stick with us and we're just going to go ahead and wrap it up. All right, people. Thanks for watching.